24. Like, comment, and subscribe. You know it. What it do? What it do, Rods Gang? It's your boy Moneybag, the Pull Up King. You know me, man. Winter, summer, fall, or spring. I'm in this thing. Hey, I had to bring my backup Crown Vic ride out here to Omar's. Me and my baby. Come on. Say hi. Say hi. Hi. Yeah, so we had to bring it um, out here to Omar's off of uh, Ledbetter and the Cliff. You know what I'm saying? Ain't nobody better to work on my Crown Vic. I told y'all I had one. Crown Vic thing. Yeah, so they just finished. $468 is what it cost me. It's cool. The ride got the icy cold air back and needed a, uh, a new air compressor for the, uh, the AC. So, uh... I'm gonna go ahead and get her loaded up. Then I'll get right back with y'all. I'll holla. They do all kind of stuff out here at uh, Omar's Automotive. State inspections, alignments, oil change, tune-ups, brakes. I even fixed the uh, my door mechanism. Uh, the door motor had gone out on the Crown Vic before. Omar fixed it. Say, so I'm telling you, I don't take my car nowhere but here. They keep their Crown Vic running, tip top shape. What's up? All right, so he just you know, told me. A lot of money in this oh yeah, car. it's a money machine. Hey, so just told me I do need front brakes and rotors. So I'm uh go ahead and go to AutoZone, price those. And then uh, go ahead and pick it up and let them put those on too. Might as well get it all done today. You know what I'm saying? That way you spend the money, it's gone. You move on, you live life, but your car is rolling and you're good. Be right back with you. Uh -huh. All right, there it go, Mike. I have to fix some vents. I almost had that wreck on, on film. On video. Man. All right, bro. I'm back in the car. So that is for now, bro. Now I gotta go down here to AutoZone and uh, go ahead and uh, price some rotors and some front brakes. I'm gonna get those put on in a different spot. I got a little uh, hookup spot to, uh, to do that. So this is the, the day in the life of owning two vehicles on the way to owning three. They always gonna need some work. It's always something. Car notes, car insurance. <laughs> it's gonna be something. Coming fast. I don't even care though. I'm gone. Made that. I did that. So yeah, let me put this seatbelt on. Because I can't have it dinging all through the video. So yeah. So man, I'm probably just gonna go to the crib and uh get online and, and price them. Shouldn't be that hard. Then I'm gonna take it uh I got a little duck off spot. A yellow building that I take it to off of uh, Polk and Camp Wisdom. Ooh, let me slow this down. Look at this road on these folks. Dang. It's hard work rolling through Old Cliff with these rims. So, yeah. That's the next thing I gotta do. But then, hey, with a car that's a 2000, it's 20 years old. And the Crown Vic is still running. Like, like what? You know what I'm saying? And so, I'm not tripping. I'm not tripping on the money that I've been saving. Not having two car notes. And the Crown Vic 
runs great. You know what I'm saying? So basically, it was just time. The car is 20 years old. So when you got a car that's 20 years old, things are gonna go out. So it, the AC, the AC compressor went out. I've actually had that car myself for, for three years and the AC compressor just not going out. I'm not even tripping, bro. So I'll gladly pay that and uh, have it right back on the road. Man, they're doing all kind of stuff over here. I didn't know they were putting no gas station right here. That's what's up. The cliff is growing. So, after I get those uh, front brake rotors done, I got to get a, a button for the um, the lights. So, basically, I got to get the lights put on a, a button so I can just turn the lights on and off from a button. Because right now, they kind of... I guess the sensor has gone out and I'm not really wanting them to even go through that, all the wires and all that. If I can just get the um, the sensor and I'll be able to cut the lights on and off, that's great, because it'll stay on, but at night they'll be on and then they'll cut off by themselves, but they be cutting on and off, like, kind of like you flashing like, here go the logs. So I'm, gonna put, I'm just gonna put them on a, uh, go ahead and you know put it on the button, that way I don't have to worry about it no more. So that's my next project. I got a lot of stuff coming up for the, the Crown Vic too. I'm talking about wraps, uh, new tail lights, door lights, um, system rims, basically the whole nine, bro. So just just watch the bill, grills, anything that you can think of. You know me. I fix up cars. That's what I do. I take plain cars and um, flip them into something nasty. Y'all know how I do. So stay with me. Quick little video, you know what I'm saying? Me uh, going ahead and uh, picking up the Crown Vic from the shop. I couldn't show you. I could have filmed it with my phone, but I didn't feel like it. I left my GoPro in my other backpack, so I didn't actually film me dropping it off this morning at Omar's. But they only had the car since this morning, since about 11.30. And it's now only 2.30. And they're already done. And it took me, you know, about 30 minutes to get here. So that I means they called me at like two to say that they were totally done. So they're fast, they get it done right. The AC is blowing cold. The window is working correctly. They gave me a chance to go ahead and tint the windows because I got the window fixed. So now I already tinted the windows. So I'm gonna be doing a lot of stuff. The interior's gotta be done. I don't know if I'm gonna keep it all sky blue. I think I might, only because I like the way it looks now. It just needs to be, you know, pepped up a little bit. So uh, keep watching my channel. You'll be seeing a lot of stuff. So I do more than Mopars. I fix up cars. That's what I do. I'm the car guy. I also do food reviews. So just stay tuned. If you're enjoying the content, go ahead and subscribe to the channel. You know what I'm saying? Comment to the channel. You know, go ahead and uh, click that notification bell so you're notified when I drop a new video. And in the corner, in the right corner at the bottom, you see that crown? You can also click that crown and subscribe. So, I'm gonna be right back with y'all. I'll holler, peace. Man, what is going on on this street? These fools act like they cannot drop it off. I should have hit up uh, Funnel Cake Paradise and got me a, a, a glazed funnel cake, bro, but I don't need that sugar, but it's good. Funnel Cake Paradise. If you're ever in uh, the area like Duncanville, Texas, on uh, Gannon Lane, make sure y'all look for two places. Wings and More and Funnel Cake Paradise. Hit them up. Hit them up. Both of them. So, and, uh, they got, uh, I think um, Wings and More has like a 10-piece a piece wings, a canned drink, and fries for like Ten dollars. I get the seasoned wings. That's that's what it's called. That's the spice. It's called season. Seasoned wings go hard. They got everything else: the barbecue, lemon pepper, Hawaiian. But I like the seasoned wings from uh, Wings and More. And then um, for like fifty cent more, they'll change that canned drink to a Kool Aid. Now you know some places they have Kool Aid, but the Kool Aid really is not what that is. At Wings and More, that Kool-Aid is what that is. So if you're ever in Duncanville, Texas, just 
Atlanta, Dallas, Texas, because one end is Dunkerville, the other end is Dallas. So on the Dunkerville side, you got Funnel Cake Paradise on Gannon Lane. On the other end, you got Wings and More, and that's the Dallas side of, you know, Gannon Lane. But hey, definitely hit them up, bro. Later on, when they open up, open up, I'm gonna do a full review on them. I just can't do it right now because they're not really letting you inside. Like you can order your food, but then you gotta stand outside until your order is ready. And then you can pick it up. So nah, I wanna go in there and show y'all how they got the cakes in there. They got, got the homemade ranch, they got the wing, they got the Kool-Aid. And they got other stuff too, you know. They got fish. They got um fries, of course, fish fries. Uh, there's a lot of stuff on that menu, bro. But uh, you're definitely gonna get full. So check them out when you get a chance. I think right now, today, I'm gonna go ahead and hit up uh Louisiana Catfish in uh, Dunkerville off of uh, Danielville. That's my spot. That's my homeboy pop shop. You know what I'm saying? Shout out uh, Fat Corey, that's a uh, Dallas rapper up and coming. So shout out to my boy. I'm about to hit up your pop's fish spot and uh, give me a three piece filet with uh, fries. I think it uh, also comes with uh, peppers and uh, pickles and, uh, and bread. So I'm, I'm hungry, man. So I'm about to get my eat on. Tartar sauce, come with tartar sauce and ketchup. So. Now that's also in uh, Dunkerville off of Danielle, but it's right off 67 in uh, Dunkerville, Texas, so it's, it's easy to get to, us, especially off and back on. So I'm ready to go up in here and get me some food. I'll get back with y'all in a minute. Peace. Oh yeah, I'm back. Say, this is the fish spot right here, bro. Y'all gotta come check them out. They got that food. I'm gonna get ready to get me something to eat, bro. And I'll get back with y'all. Uh. Yes, sir. Louisiana catfish and chicken. <coughs> that boy. Just look at the windows, dog. I can't see. Nah. So they got a, a Monday and Wednesday special. They got like shrimp baskets, catfish filet. So the Monday and Wednesday special is a two-piece dark leg and a thigh for one dollar. That's Mondays and Wednesdays. Yeah, that's the same special. Mondays and Wednesdays, two-piece dark leg and a thigh. But they also got link baskets. Wednesday only special, five-piece regular, eight dollars. Hey, right, they show you right there, cash only. And of course, with the Corona stuff going on. Must have masks to um, enter the store. They got pork chop baskets. Y'all check out them times. Louisiana Catfish and Chicken, Sunday through Monday, from 11.30 a.m. to 8.30 p.m. Tuesday and Thursday, from 11.30 to 10 p.m. Fridays, from 11.30 a.m. to 11.30 p.m. And on Saturdays, 11.30 a.m. to 11 p.m. 10 piece dark leg and thigh, $9. Without fries, $10 with fries. They got catfish steak. So when they, another one day special. Okay, so they also got chicken baskets and, and cakes. Hit them up. I gotta give me something to eat. Oh yeah. Here. Bow, bow. <laughs> Get 
came over to get my lotto tickets too. I'm trying to win it. For real, for real this time, y'all. This is gonna be the end of this video. I'm gonna get back with y'all tomorrow. Again, make sure you are subscribing to the channel, liking, commenting, sharing, exploring. I'm going up all 2020. I am Moneybag, the Pull Up King, winning summer, fall, and spring. I am in that thing. Salute, you already know. About to get this cut up, man. Hey, it looks like right now, until it slows down, I'm gonna have to get like a haircut a week just because my hair is just used to, to growing now. All right, peace. Hey, y'all go subscribe to my boy Royalty on 24s, man. He got one of the hardest RTs, man. For real, for real. Hey, the interior and all the guts and all that good stuff.